Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 4 of Let's Play Crash Bandicoot The Huge Adventure. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Let's go down the hole! Which of course is level 14 of game. So let's see what we're gonna find here. Of course an extra life would be nice. And since this level is called Down the Hole, I assume we're gonna be going down most of the time. And also gotta be careful with the spikes, cause you know, they're obviously no good. Four, five! Five bounces! Ah, 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 ah. Damn it! Note to self, don't try the Count's laugh when you feel you're gonna be a little bit at a risky point. As shown there. That shut me up in a hurry. For a few seconds at least, but let's not worry about that anymore. Can't believe I still botched that. That's better. Just how did I not get it right the first time? Get on there quickly so I can get to these crates. That seemed a bit risky, but I made it work. Hey, what's up? What, have got? Huh, what happens if I go down? Well, actually, nothing bad's gonna happen. I can still get over there, which is good. Pull one up. Perfect. Now it looks like I'm inside some kind of temple. That's gotta be some very wild hair they got there. At least I think it's hair. Could be just some kind of native feather. Or headdress. But in any case, they're trying to shoot darts at me, therefore they must die. Self-defense, y'all. Of course, I gotta look for every single crate I see that I can reach. I think I can get the gem here. At least I hope I can. Whoa! Okay, it shoots high and then it shoots low. I gotta be careful with that. I don't think I'll be able to hit all three of these boxes with a single body slam, so why don't we get the first one? Then I can aim for these. You know, just in case I can't get back up there. Oh, I botched it. I have to kill myself. Just don't land right on a checkpoint. I offer myself to the gaming gods as a sacrifice for my indiscretions. Now let's see if I can get... <sighs> Damn it! Oh, now I get that one. That was another botch. It's too bad you had to go like quite a distance to die. Did I actually miss the crystal that previous run too? Let's do it like this, just to be safe. Come on, crash. That's better! Now I don't have to kill myself. Let's finish this level guilt free! ceiling is so low, you can't do the body slam. Have to approach it from the side. Oh, the checkpoint's right there, good. Okay, it's 58 boxes I got. I see the bonus over there. Hopefully this one will not require numerous retries. 21 boxes? That's manageable. I think we can do it. I hope. Preferably on the first try, thank you. Like, I think I could have gotten like 
three boxes in a row with one body slam, but I didn't want to risk it. Hmm. Let's do this. Go, but wait, do I actually want to activate that next? No, I want to get this. Now I can activate it. No guilt whatsoever. Okay, how am I gonna make this jump? Did I screw myself over? Nope! I can just do that. Did I get all the boxes? Yes, I did. Good. But I can't be ours to deal with a bonus stage multiple times like last time, the previous video. I was on to you! Good thing I practiced this level days ago. Well, by the time I'm recording this, which will be December 15th. Wait. I'm missing many boxes here. Was there a path I missed? I'm pretty sure there was. But man, missing like eight... That many boxes, there's no excuse. I'll come back to that level later, don't worry. Don't get in a tizzy just because I missed one gem. If I could have gotten it right away. There's always another chance. Like, I don't like when people get so anal and completely upset over one little video game mistake. It's not the end of the world. Come on. Learn to suck it up and move on with your lives. In any case, let's not worry about that now. Instead, let's all worry about this crap. And now these planes move. The bullets move pretty fast, which is a big worry. Oh, I botched it. Okay, I'm gonna try to get this gem. Because I didn't get the first checkpoint, I might as well just exit out of the level and do it again. It'll be much faster. I think I was too preoccupied with the boxes that I ignored the nitros. Oh well. Live and learn. Take out the enemies as soon as possible, I should have no worries. And I'll have less distractions. Okay, did I miss one crate? I hope I didn't. If I didn't get the gem, it was because of that one crate. There's just so much to worry about in this stage here. hard to keep yourself attentive to everything. But I'm gonna do my best here. I mean, if I missed one crate, then I'll just go back to the level again. No worries. I don't know if I'll actually do it on camera, though, because, I mean, what's the point? I mean, every crate is visible. Just going in a straightforward path. That's it. Okay, you guys are being very annoying. You have to die now. Man, how many planes does Cortex have? Do you have like some kind of airport? And a bunch of Zeppelins with missiles? I mean, they're not as good as the Kiros in Command Conquer Red Alert 2, but they're lethal enough. Just annoying. That glaring weakness needs to be fixed, though. If you're gonna make your weak point your own face, I mean, you deserve to have your blimps destroyed. Oh, that bomb stuck right next to me. 
these planes can really whittle down your health. Health great! Health great! Where are you? Oh, down to twelve percent. This cannot be good at all. But at least when you get back to a checkpoint, you're at a hundred percent. Okay, thirty percent. Great. Okay, I'm much higher now. I'm getting health crates. Oh, I did get all the crates. Good. So I don't have to go. Oh my god, I'm down to 32% already? Man, you get no invincibility time here. And it really shows. Okay, is it just me or these missiles going faster? I lose 6% per hit? Yep, it's 6%. Whoa. Oh man, you had another weapon! Good thing I dodged all the blasts. Otherwise, I'd have been dead. Okay, so I'm missing one, two, three, three gems here. Okay, that's not too bad. I'm close to the end of the game. Now I gotta take on Tiny. This is actually a very easy battle, very pattern based. You see the leaves falling in a certain spot, that means he's gonna land on that platform. Just keep alternating from platform to platform, and then he stops, spin into him. Then I'm gonna take out the top platform, like so. Oh, that one was a bit too high for me. For some reason, I thought they were the same height. But yeah, that's what you need to do. It's not a complicated battle at all. For some reason, he always seems to take out the same platforms, no matter what. Use that to your advantage. That way you can exploit his pattern. Like so. And now we pretty much got him. Like that. Tornado spin. Push B repeatedly to spin longer and temporarily float. Perfect. Cortex! I knew this would happen! Crash has defeated three of your stooges! He must be stopped. I will not tolerate another failure. Uka! I'm sorry. However, do not be overly concerned. My planetary minimizer will stop him. Wait, planetary minimizer used on a living being? Can that actually work? Okay, so these are the last five levels. Start to finish. Air supply. No fly zone. Drip, drip, drip. And final countdown. So, yep, apparently the next boss is Cortex himself. So, should I actually go for one of the gems now that I now that I can get it? I believe it was this one. Ruined. No, I don't want to do the time trial, otherwise I won't be able to get the gem. I can go for a relic, though, but... Once again, I'm saving those for later. I already got the silver gem, so I can just ignore most of these crates. The tornado spin, you just gotta keep tapping B while you're in the air. Or just pretty much anywhere, but it's more useful when you're jumping. Just try not to tap it too much in case you need to jump right away. Otherwise, you could screw yourself. So why don't I meet you back where we're gonna find the blue gem, okay? Give me a moment. Okay, I'm here. You just gotta get on this nitro switch detonator, and then jump. Do the tornado jump, there you go. Like so. Like so. And now we gotta make this jump. And I botched it. So unfortunately, whenever you screw up, you have to do it again. Hopefully I don't have to use the bird, because if I do, then it's going to be a little bit of a problem. But maybe it won't. Maybe a double jump and tornado spin will be enough. Let's give it a try. Oh dear, I think I might have botched it. But let me try a slide jump, double jump, and then the tornado spin. 
So I really hope I did not need to use the bird, because if I do, then I have to leave the level, or kill myself, and then do it all over again. I don't want it to come to that. Okay, I can still make it. Got it! Now I got the blue gem. So I actually need to finish the stage, otherwise I can't keep the gem. Why don't you give me another couple minutes and I'll meet you back at the hub. Okay, I'm back, and now I got the blue gem in my possession. Which is perfect. I'm gonna save some other levels where I can get gems for later. But for now, let's actually do the rest of the stages I can still do. Start to finish. Apparently I can get a red gem here. Not like that, of course! 113 boxes? Oh, this could take a while. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a bonus. Okay, that's pretty cool. Whenever you see these little fans over there, they can make you spin. You do the tornado spin automatically. That could have been disastrous. I should have thought to use the double jump. But whatever. I made it through unscathed. The one thing I hate about the tornado spin as a result of this is that you lose whatever Wumper Fruit you come in contact with. Because you're spinning them out of the way. I remember these enemies from Crash 2. You gotta be patient when dealing with them. Why can't I just get most of them that way? Okay, how are we gonna do this? Okay, well, that seems pretty easy enough. I thought there'd be some kind of puzzle involved, but I was wrong. Okay. Do I. Is there a way to go down? Good question. But let me focus on going up first. There might be two paths through this. Let's see if this works. Yep, it does. That's what I needed to do. So I'm gonna focus on the top path, and then I'll work my way down. might be what I have to do in order to get through this. Um, that botched, didn't it? Yep, I thought so. So what one did I really need to not trigger? Let's see if I can figure this out. Wait, there must be no bottom path, yep. It was all one path. I had to see it for myself, you know. Okay, let's see, can I get this done on this try? I really hope I do. Because doing a bonus stage over and over again, like you've seen, gets tiresome. Of course, don't jump on that, otherwise you will die. Okay, let's see. Uh, yep, that's the right one. Has to hit the bottom first, deal with the crate, and then work my way down. I mean, work my way up, I should say. Looks like I'm not done yet. Thirty-nine. Oh, there's another one down here. Forty-four. And the other three were the nitro. So once I find the nitro detonator, then I'll take care of them too. I got it figured out, boys and girls. Don't panic. <laughs> You gotta die now. 
yeah, I think that was time. Just to play it safe, I'm just gonna do the body slams like this. Just in case I botch it. You gotta move. Uh. You were getting a little too close for comfort. Take out one at a time and then spin through the body slam through the hole. Gotta find a checkpoint. Preferably soon, there it is. Oh, the UFOs are back. But they're very easy to manage. I mean, they got a very simple pattern. So do these guys. Hmm, let's see. I think this works. I don't think there was any crate that was very high to reach. At least I hope not. Otherwise I botched it. Okay, I need 33 more boxes. Yeah, it's a... God. I didn't really need that enemy, but... Just wanted to be special. I mean, nice special, not Ralph Wiggum special. But in any case... Uh, Nitro. If I find the Nitro detonator, that's gonna take care of a lot of boxes right there. Huh. That leaves me with four. But where are the remaining four? Preferably over here. Yep. All in a tight-knit package. That was pretty close. I could've died there. And that would've been very embarrassing. Thank you. Okay, there's the exit. Okay, so I didn't get the red gem. But I'm sure there's another way to do it. I'll find that on my own time, so don't panic. I'm gonna stop the video here in the next episode. Let's do air supply. See ya.